Uh, what are some signs a woman is not feeling you? Oh man, I mean, well, the number one sign is is that she's not listening to what you're saying. So this is why I, I usually tell guys when they interact with women, you have to instruct them on doing something. So you know what I mean? Like, and 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 this can just go even like when you're just setting up a date. So you say to a girl, hey, you know, uh, let's meet up Friday at eight o'clock for some drinks. Meet me at so-and-so bar, right? So you're telling her to do this. So all you're looking for is for her to say, okay, cool, sounds good. You know, I'll see you there, whatever, whatever. But if she's like, oh, well, you know, I don't really drink. Can we like go get dinner? She's not really feeling you. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? Because a woman who feels you, she's always going to follow your lead. Even if she doesn't drink, all she's going to okay. do, she's going to come to the to the bar and she's going to drink a non-alcoholic drink. But she's mm, not going to, okay. she's not going to, resist because she actually wants it to happen. So I always tell guys that resistance, any form of resistance is some form of disinterest. And so what, what a lot of guys have to look for is highly interested women, because I always tell guys is that there's three levels of interest is high interest, medium interest, and low interest. So high interest is when a woman is extremely interested in you. She's about what you're about. She follows your lead. There's no resistance. She's making it happen. Medium interest is where a woman, she's interested in you, but you're not her top choice. So therefore, because you're not her top choice, she's not going to be fully hundred percent invested in just doing what you want. So she'll give you a little friction. Low interest is a woman who doesn't really like you as like a romantic or sexual partner, but she likes the fact that you're there. You give her attention. You'll be like a pen pal friend zone type of guy. You see what I'm saying? So yep, depending yep. on her, you know, interaction, that's going to show you her level of interest. You see what I'm saying? You telling a woman where we're meeting, what time mm -hmm. we're getting there. Right. Women need that. They exactly. want that. Yeah. And my point is, is that a woman, like you said, there, there's three levels of interest. If she's not interested in you, but you come out, say, hey, we're going here. We're meeting here at this time. And she's willing to be there. That puts you in a different class than the other guy she's dealing with. You taking action. You taking a risk. Mm -hmm. And that's why a lot of these men out here who who think that we, we always look at these, these women out here. Why is she with him? Right. Like, he took action. Mm -hmm. She may have looked at him for five seconds. I'm not feeling him, but because he took action, right? He's got he's got the prize. Mm -hmm. The the thing that men are understanding is when you take some action, I'm not allowing you to put me in a friend zone. Mm -hmm. Women like for you to tell them, this is where we're meeting, this is what time we're meeting, and this is this is how we're meeting. Right, right. That sets you apart from the other ten guys that's blowing up her phone right now. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Because she's getting got she's getting guys every day. Guys are pursuing her every day. Right. Right. And that's what sets you apart by the action you're taking. Mm -hmm. I would say you spoke on most of what I was gonna say, but the, the <laughs> big thing is like closed mouths don't get fed. Right. I mean, even yeah. if we're even if we're moving away from dating, like career-wise, mm -hmm. just if you want something make it known but don't just make it known like start taking the actions required to get you to that place yeah. right. uh for instance like there there are folks who say all all the time like oh i haven't gone anywhere in my career some some of that sure it could be the the field you're in or the the uh the place you're working for it could be that but how many people actually know you're trying to advance how many people actually know you're trying to move up how many right. people actually know you're trying to make changes it's it's speaking something into existence right you you can't if you can't say it out loud then nobody's going to believe it <clears throat> mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and it's the and, same thing in data no i was going to say I, I i'll equate this to the job thing right if a job knows that you're trying to advance mm -hmm. and you know they're like we don't have any positions open for you right now mm -hmm. we can't or we can't pay you like we want to pay you or, you know, they well, we can get you here, but we can't put you where you want to be. As a man, what are you going to do? You got options. You're going to be like, I, I ain't taking this. I'm going to go look for a new job right. that'll pay me what I want. That'll put me in the position that I want to do. Mm. So why don't we equate that to dating? Mm. Right? right? If if she's not going to put you in the position that you want to be in, if she's not going to accept you for the masculinity that you need to be in, why not look for a new woman? 